This is Jack Motive now reporting live from Spirit Beach Raceway. It's currently an absolute downpour and conditions are at an all-time low. Um, how, do, how do I hold the, whoa, just drop the microphone right there. Yeah, conditions aren't good right now. Uh, Washington, don't come here, not good. Currently 7.55 a.m. and we are at a little meeting point down at Starbucks for where we're gonna gather a group of friends and we're all gonna drive down to Spirit Peaks. If you guys have been keeping up with the previous two drifting vlogs, I've previously been drifting at Evergreen Speedway. That's where FD drifts, but it's just basically a big open speedway area. Spirit is more of a technical course with a lot more tight turns. So I feel like with our past two days in mind, I think it's time to step the level up onto a different type of course to learn on drifting. Today we're gonna try and tackle spirit but it's supposed to be wet and raining so it's gonna be another wet drift day I think but we'll see maybe maybe we'll keep some dry ground for as long as we can sitting here we got our new bash bar looking aggressive as hell we got Mark's car we got Brennan's Miata and we're gonna have more people rolling in here in a second you guys are probably like Jack how come your car still looks the same for basically the third drift vlog that we have here I'm gonna be doing wheels I'm gonna be doing new wheels and with new wheels is gonna come a new set of tires so that's why I wanted to do this drift event with these tires and fully burn them all off because we still got a good amount there so I wanted to basically run these as long as I possibly could and as far as the fronts go you can see we're definitely gonna be pushing our limits here Bro, is that a famous TikToker? Okay, screw that. Prius, the Prius posting up, you know how it do? Yeah, that's, that's holding on my tires. For real? Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a trailer, so I brought a Prius. Yeah, I mean, that works. Word. Oh. Woo! Y'all might have remembered Jesse's S14 Koki from the vlogs. Well, he was always on stock wheels, and now he's finally got some Weds Stancy Boy Hot Boys on there. <laughs> Yo, just ask Jesse things you feel. I'm gonna fix it right now. Yeah. Did you break a tab? Wait, oh, did my bumper come off? Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah it's kind of hanging. Oh, I, think you I, just, just I, didn't, it off. I didn't want you to break it when this you went in reverse. This is so dumb. I hate this fucking car. <laughs> oh my God. I think you just did. Hey, but this, oh, I did. But this car looks really cool, uh, though. <laughs> Yo, you need a zip tie? Oh, um, man, dude. Yeah. Shit, dude. That, no, JB Weld. Yo, that's, well, that's why we're gonna we're gonna jack it up right now. He has he has a thing, and I, I have my. I got a drill. Why don't just drill a yeah, hole? And... Yeah, that's yeah, what I was okay. saying. We should drill yeah, a hole and zip tie it up. I've got a drill. Yeah. I'll drill your shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> just me but we have a hell of a squad for this drift event god dang his front end all clean nice complete mine freaking uh, freaking zanky bumper uh. so he's worried about rubbing in the fender on his coil yeah on his coil yeah but i can almost my finger can almost go in it i said it should be fine see the finger a little clearance in there yeah, Are we good? Yeah, let me just get the front bumper up. We're going drifting today. That had, that had no emphasis. You get more emphasis. What? More emphasis. We're going drifting today. Yeah. We're going drifting yeah. today. Come on, let's go drifting. All right. Cool car cruises, but seeing this makes
many JDM cars out here taking over the freeway is just completely something else. Picked up some trash on the freeway on his front end. He's gonna try and blow it off. Oh, I saw some of it come off. Oh my god. Status support, it's now gotten to the point where it's literally blinding. Outside, the camera can literally see more clearly than I can right now. My window was just straight white. So after about two hours of driving, we've made it here to Spirit Peaks and immediately I can tell that this is a way bigger deal than just evergreen open drifts because there are more drift cars here than any other event I've ever partaken in. This is pretty wild. Send in the SC? No, no. Aw, oh, sad. No, 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 no. Sad. I guess you gotta protect the gram lights at all costs. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Yo, greetings. Good morning, senor. Good morning. So we got these neon wristbands to check us in as drivers. So guys, next time you come here, print out some neon bands. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They change them up every time. Don't even try. That is a clean Drift 350 right there, if I do say so myself. What an E30 Frankenstein. This thing is wicked. That's wild. We are officially in and registered here at Spirit Peaks. All of the cars are already going at it over there in the background. This track goes a little bit different than Evergreen that you basically, once you're out there, you can go basically as long as you want until they decide to flag everyone in or someone in because something happened. But you basically get a lot more seat time out there. But at the same time, there's other cars that you have to watch out for and be courteous of. So um, it's currently dry right now. We've lucked out that we hit a lot of rain on the way here and there might be rain that's coming that might be creeping up on us but it's not here yet so I'm honestly thinking that we just don't waste any time and we just send her and get immediately right out there so that we could uh, start feeling out the track while it's dry okay here we go this is the most impulsive send I think I've ever had that we're just immediately gonna put ourselves out on the track going out there, my boy. dude we're going we're fucking going, we're going. Oh, yeah, track goes. 
for the first time ever on a technical course like that, I say that wasn't that bad. It could have been worse. I think I'm definitely like, hands are still all over the place, but we linked some corners. It's, uh, it's intense, but once you get the hang of it, it's it's hella fun. Oh, okay, that's good. That's, that's what I'll say. I think the biggest thing for me is like people like creeping up on you yeah. that you know like are out there behind you because yeah, spinning out, it's like, it's definitely like, I haven't even spun out yet, but I can tell that fear is going to be there yeah, when it happens. The track is like full. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of guys out there. You got enough clearance? Right there? I don't know, dude. Because, uh, I hope so. it's a little rough out there. Is it? Yeah, it's, it's bumpy, but it's wild. Yeah, as long as you go home with the intention that you may not come home with the same quality fenders as you showed up here with, then, uh, you'll have fun. All right, round two, here we go. Authentic drifting now. Tire check. Uh, definitely a little rocky, but uh, still holding up. We got Brennan in the house. What up? It's me, Brennan. <laughs> I'm in the house. My man has the angle to do it. He's not going to apologize for it. Oh, that's the guy I was talking to. Yeah, uh, two. All right, tandeming with Jakey in the S14. What up? What, 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 what? Let's what get it. <laughs>
water break session. Too much rain. We all piling in the tent setup. Holy cow, this looks like a cult. Yo, shout out mom. This is a she came here, before. she packed him the lunch. She got the lunch box. Yo, what else we packing in here? Hey, hey, that's for me to find out. Dude, I saw them gold fishies in there. Yeah, you fucking know it. We got the Capri Sun. Fun Dude, fact. I was. I ate all Brennan's goldfish. <laughs> he actually still owes me goldfish because of it. Bro, that is true. I did them dirty. I hate the whole bowl, right, Brennan? He ate the whole bowl. <laughs> oh my god. Man, Jesse just be eating my booty all day. <laughs> hey, Jack, you wanna go for a ride? Uh, sure. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. Let's cook the rice. Oh, boy. It's not even here. <laughs> Where'd it go? <laughs> Where'd it go? <laughs> what? What happened? I had something there, didn't I? Dude, we gotta go find it. Now I gotta get my binoculars. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go on a scavenger hunt for your bumper. Okay, okay. It's not bad. It's still in one piece. No way. I'm literally trying to save the day right now. Dude, the ultimate trooper. It survives the drift day and now it's rescuing other drift car parts. I love this thing to death. I truly love everything about it. Yeah, not all heroes wear capes. Oh, it was good. There it is, oh, dude. It's, it's still in one good, piece. Man. Yeah, it's chilling. <laughs> <laughs> Let's zip it on and go again. Dude, it's a survivor. Hey, thanks for grabbing it for me. Dude. Yeah, no problem. A real one, for sure. God. <laughs> dude, like, I... That's it? Yeah, that's, that's it. it. That's it. Man. That's just some battle scars. That's it. Oh, <laughs> bro, why? It's not even that bad. Oh my god. You want to go again? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll take a little break for now. Uh, it's currently pouring down rain right now, but it don't matter. Everyone's out here sending it. We're going drifting today. So uh, let's see what we got. Uh, my buddies are out here. Uh, we got intro vertical J key. Coming up over there. Uh, and then, oh, Brennan just spun out. Um, okay, so we got some E36s right here. Those don't sound that good. Uh, BRZ, those are a little bit slow. We're kind of like imprisoned here be behind the fence right now. But so right here we got an RX8. This thing's thick, major specs. Uh, right there, that's uh, my boy Austin's old chaser. Uh, yes, that is like his actual old black chaser that's in my old vlogs. 
That is the new owner and he's wrapped it purple, pink, Barney, whatever you want to call it. And he's drifting it out here. Tristan in the automatic IS, ripping some tires right now, slaying. Uh, we got... Yeah, they really don't sound that good, but another orange E36. There's only one thing in the world that could sound worse than E36 and... Oh! There's a VQ. Uh, we have this interesting uh, Flame 5 Series. And there's our... God, that is so sick. Oh, he almost hit the wall. He spun out. He almost hit the wall. These cars are hella cool and all, but I'm just grateful to have the amazing friends that I do. When you get to make more cool car friends, it's just the people that matter. That's what really ends up mattering in the end, and that's what stands out the most. I just wanted to let you guys all know that.